Do you need an umbrella? Yeah. I said bring a uh, bring it bring an umbrella in the in the um on the advert. I can't hold an umbrella and an umbrella. Fair enough. You need your own umbrella person. Look yeah yeah Jeff will Uh, this building's been standing for about oh, 20 years and it hasn't been used. So initially back in the day, this was the crisis care accommodation. So people would come in, um, you know, get their short term accommodation and get off the street for the night. Um, it means a lot to me because I used to sleep there underneath where, you, where, you, where you're uh, standing and another uh, number of other people have as well. It's probably one of the biggest squats we've got in Perth um, so with forced entry you can get in access into the building to sleep at night now that will occur probably a trespassing um, charge or the cops might give you a move on notice and uh, board up the place and kick you out so you know those sorts of things you get very good at especially if there's um, you know nowhere to sleep and it's raining so you know you're probably just covered up there although if the wind was blowing in that direction you'd get wet so this this place um you know just stands there when you know the health department deemed it um unfit to be used so it's just little things like that in our in our state that you know makes you wonder why you know, it's still standing for so long and hasn't been demolished or uh, re-renovated um, to be able to be up, up to that health standard. So the reason why I stopped you here is because this was also a place where we used to sleep. I also used to sleep on the top, top uh, level of the car park, but usually kicked out by security guards, um, which would turn quite ugly uh, most of the time because obviously you don't want to leave and they don't want you there and usually resulted in police coming to give you a move on notice or a trespass mo notice so <laughs> you that? so th the other thing was I used to sleep around here uh, on a summer's day um, why? because United Care West and all the community service providers are actually just over in this spot and I'll be able, you'll be able to get a better feel for it when we walk in there and also see what's available for if you are homeless and it ever happens to you or you might be in food crisis where you can get some uh, food relief assistance or uh, clothing or family planning for your kids or something if you're in hardship <laughs> any questions